I am so excited you're going to draw my cousin today! What's up everybody, welcome back to yet another Drawing Card 2 tutorial and today we are celebrating 300 subscribers! You guys did it! You guys did it! We are at 300 subscribers! Last time I checked, we're actually a little bit more too. So keep on telling your friends and getting them to subscribe. Okay. Uh, I promised we would do the final five people that subscribe to put us over the 300 threshold mark. So, I'm giving a shout out to TDSK, <laughs> Layla Mitchell, Nicole Lawrence, Xiao Wen Ping, and Wagner Ahmad. You guys did it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And... Today, we promise you a bonus lesson from the Wild Kratz, the Hermit Crab. And there it is. So, we hope you enjoyed it. We'll see. I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. This is not it. Uh, right now, we got to get our three P's out. Your paper, your pen, and your pencil. Hope you have an eraser, because you might need it. And... Let's get going. We're going to turn our papers landscape or sideways. And once we have that, we're going to put on there a nice, beautiful circle egg. Now, once we've got that circle egg thingy there, we're going to go and make a circle. That kind of cuts right through it, just like that. And again, it's okay if your circles are all scribbly like mine. You can tell them you meant to do that. Okay, and as you can see, we're going kind of right down the middle of the circle into the egg. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to take the side of this circle that we just made. We're going to make another circle, a little bit smaller. Kind of goes right down the center. We're going to do it again with this circle, right down the center. I think we're going to make a little bit of a border there. Down the circle. Oh, okay. God. Now we're done. No, now we got the shell. <laughs> All right. What we're going to do is we're going to go to the side right here of the first circle that we made, and we're going to make a curved line, and it's going to go from the bottom of the shell all the way up, just like that. So we're like breaking the shell a little bit here. We're going to go about to the top of this circle right here that we made. We're going to kind of go down here to here, and we're going to just make a slightly curvy line like that. All right, so once you got this slanting line, we're going to come back up here with a fish hook. See the fish hook, everybody? Yeah, let's go fishing. Let's go fishing. We're going fishing for a hermit crab. All right, once we got our, <laughs> we got our poles in the water, and wait, we're, we're, we're drawing, we're not fishing. What am I doing? All right, so at the tip of here, we're going to draw an oval. Right like that, and right next to it, we're going to do another oval. Then we're going to underneath each of those ovals and draw a little smiley face. Just like that. Then we're going to go right back to this fish hook that we made, and we're going to make a curvy line from the side of this egg with a smiley face and go right down into there. We're going to go the other side and do another slant, uh, slanty, a uh, curvy line into there. We're going to go over here to this other one that we made, and we're going to make a curvy line, but it goes into there. So it looks like, and we're going to erase this stuff in the middle here. All right, we got our crabby, crab, crab happening here. We're also going to make a curvy line from underneath of this bottom one here, and we're just going to go like that. Boom, like that. All right, so we're going to go to the bottom of this V here, and we're just going to make a big circle just like that. Out of this circle, we're going to make a rectangle, a long rectangle. Boom, boom, boom. We're going to bring that rectangle straight down with a straight line, like that. And then over here, on this side, we're going to make a little curvy line. And it doesn't just curve there, it goes all the way down like that. And then right about at the end of this one, we're going to make it kind of like a little fingernail or a little little claw thing here. All right. All right. 
So, we're going to take this circle, which is kind of like our magic tea, because there is no magic tea today. Oh, I miss the magic tea. So, we're going to use this circle, and we're basically just going to go straight down. We're going to make a curvy line that goes straight down like that. And then we're going to go back up like that. So it's a little bit, it's a little bit shorter than this other one. Okay, so the next leg is actually going to come out of this circle again. And this one we're going to just do a little, it's a little slanty line that goes up like that. And a little straight line that goes across like that. And then we're going to make another curved line, but it's going to go the opposite way of this way. Opposite curve. So just like that. And uh, and then we're going to go back up here. I'm going to make this line just a little bit longer. Like that. And we're going to, after we make it a little bit longer, we're going to follow this straight down. Like that. Hermit crab, here he comes. All right. So now we can erase this bit here. Like that. So right now he's got three legs. And he looks kind of like a tripod for the world. With three legs. And we don't want that. So. Let's make his fourth, and then fifth leg, and then sixth. How many legs does this guy have? A lot. All right, so we're going to come out of this leg that we just made, kind of halfway into it, right? And we're going to make a little slanty line, shooting up. Just shooting up a little bit. Just like that. And then it's going to be a... We basically need to get down here. We need to get down here. And we're going to just draw a line going straight down. Could be a slanty line, could be what, uh, basically though, we need to do two lines, parallel lines. Two lines that follow the same path but never touch. So, I didn't do a very good job. Mine kind of don't follow the same path. There we go. Alright, and then we're going just to connect them with a triangle. See how we made a triangle there? So, connect it and then erase it. Alright. All right, so it looks kind of weird. He's got a little stick coming out there, so we're gonna make one more stick connecting it, and then we can erase there. All right, we're getting there, we're getting there. All right, his last leg, Whew, finally. This circle again. So we're gonna see this straight line we made earlier. We're gonna just follow it across here like that. I'm gonna draw it. But, um, and then we're going to make a little rectangle right there. Just like that. Then we're going to make a slanty line that goes straight down. We're going to do that again. Make this line a little bit longer. And slanty line straight down. Just like that. And then we're going to make a triangle. But then we're going to erase the triangle part. Alright. Now you know what's happening here. We're erasing all that stuff. Alright. So our hermit crab is almost completed for the basic stuff. Um, we need to get his last claw, so we're going to make a circle, and it's just above this claw right here. So, make a nice big circle like that. We're going to go in the middle of that circle, and we are going to make a slanty line coming right out, like that. Okay? And then right from just a little bit over, so it's just a little bit over, we're going to make a curvy line, just like that. See what we've done? All right, we're going to take that slanty line that we made, and we're going to go to the end, and we're going to connect it to the side of that circle. We're going to do the same thing to this one. We're going to go right up there and to the side of this circle. Then we're going to take the center of these guys, and we're going to make inside a bunch of little triangles. Little triangles. Boop, 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 boop. Okay? And then what we're going to do is we're going to erase. So we got to erase... The triangle's out of here, which is what I'm doing. I mean, I'm racing the... So make sure he's got a claw that's serrated. All right. So at the end of this circle, we're going to make a straight line going straight up like that. And when we get up a ways up to his eyeball, right, we're going to make a curvy line from the circle up to that straight line. Right, so... From the tip of this claw, we're just going to make a curved line, go straight down. So once you got this line, we're going to go from here, and we're going to make a nice big curvy line that goes straight back down to the crab like that. All right? And then we're actually going to 
connect it with a little line like that. All right, so now we've got the big claw. You can erase all this stuff inside here. Whoops. And all right, so now we've got all the pieces of the puzzle here. We can erase. And now we can start on the details. Details on this. First, we're going to start with the eyes. We're going to do a circle up here, circle up here, and a smiley face or smile. And then we're going to connect it like that. All right. Um, right here, we're going to draw. make the letter U or a, C, a letter C, and we're going to put two C's just like that. We're going to erase everything inside the C's. And we're going to put some little squiggly hairs that are coming out of him. <laughs> that's not quite right, but that's fine. All right, let's take a look at all the other pieces here. Uh, right where we have this big O, we're going to erase this part here. And we're going to just put a curved line like that. All right, and then right here where we have the claw from the corner of the corner, we're going to make a, a curvy line. And then we're going to make one more curvy line like that. <laughs> Look at this guy's kneecap. And we're just going to draw a straight line going across there. And then two curved lines like that. Going down to this guy over here, we're going to make a curved line like that in a little line. Uh, going to this leg, we're going to make a big curved line and a smaller curved line. All right, going right above these legs here, we're going to make a letter L sort of thing. <laughs> All right, let's, let's fix the shell, right? So... We want to make all these intersection lines erased, which is what we're doing right now. All right, looking good, looking good. All right, and he's got a bunch of patterns. We're going to start with the small one. We got a big oval right here and three small ovals going across. This one's got three oval like shapes, so we're going to just do like that. All right. And then the next show, we've got one, two, three, four, four shapes. So you can kind of make this thing some, some circular, could be different sizes as you can see what I'm doing. All right, and the bigger one, they're getting bigger. The shapes get bigger now. And he's got one, two, three, four. Seems like he's getting more shapes as we get bigger. <laughs> four, five, six. All right. And then on uh, the other, the bigger one, he's got a huge shape up here. Um, like I said, they don't have to be the same exact, but you want to make bigger shapes. I think is the is the key. Um, all right, looking at his eyes, we can fill in his eyes. Just don't fill in those little spaces we made, the little circle and the little uh, smiley thing. Looking at his claw, we want to. Just make lines going past those parts that we made earlier so that he's got like, yeah. <laughs> and then uh, we're going to make two curvy lines like that. Uh, looking uh, over by his leg, we do two curvy lines there. Let's see. Let's do, we'll do two curvy lines right there. Oh, his last leg. It didn't give him anything. Curvy line there and a letter M. And then up here. Do another curvy line sideways and a uh, sideways letter M. All right, there he is, the hermit crab. Ink these in, color them up. We want to see them. We want you to send us this bonus lesson drawing of the hermit crab. Send it to our Facebook page. We do got one. Yes, we do. Send it over. We want to see your art. We're going to post them up on our end of the year video. And I uh, hope you enjoyed this one. Keep on drawing the more you do the better you get, and we will be back with Chris, no, not Chris, with Martin Kratt <laughs> in the Peregrine Falcon, because that's what's next. You want to draw more?
Well, we got more videos for you to watch. Check out any of these, and please share this with all your friends. Let's get more people drawing. The more you draw, the better you get. All right, see you at the next video.